Hi everyone, welcome to the AP Residence Chemistry. Now let us continue our lectures on like uh, electrochemistry. Particularly today we are going to discuss the salt bridge, complete concept of salt bridge. Okay, in previous sessions I had discussed about like a uh, electrolytic cell and electrochemical cell representation those things. In particularly galvanic or voltaic cells we used the salt bridge. Okay, now in this session we are deal with uh, how it is used, when it is used why it is used okay simple three things uh, how it is used when it is used what are the uses of uh, uh, using of salt bridge okay so the first of all why it is used first of all why it is used now in previous session so this is an uh, off cell like it is a left hand off cell so here it is the right hand off cell okay here it is the solution here it is the like a rod so here it is the solution that is nothing but a zinc sulfate solution here it is the like a copper sulfate solution copper sulfate solution okay so zinc rod present in the zinc sulfate solution copper rod present in the copper sulfate solution so here these two are connected through a an electric wire these two are connected through a an electric wire so these are whenever we will switch the electricity we will pass the some of the electricity through these uh, electrolytic cell so here zinc rod lost their electrons and it forms the zinc plus 2 form so uh, now here it releases the some electrons now the releasing of electrons uh, which fl flows through the uh, electrical wire and it at, it attracts the those electrons by the copper sulfate solution copper plus 2 here copper plus 2 and uh, so 4 minus 2 so these copper plus 2 will gains the electron two electrons and it forms the copper solution and it forms the like a copper metal so these copper metal will deposited at a corresponding electrode that is this is nothing but a cathode okay so here it is the anode here it is the cathode so cathode always deposition deposition takes place at cathode and liberation takes place at anode okay now here it is deposited like this so that means uh, here the releasing of electrons whenever the electricity passed through the electrolytic solution here the releasing of electrons uh, and uh, electrons left the like a uh, cations that means here it is the more number of cations are present more number of cations are present okay so now the more number of cations will attract the electrons that's why it uh, somewhat uh, it troubles the electron flowing it uh, it it prevents the electron flowing somewhat it prevents the electron flowing why because here it is the positive charge the positive charge will obstruct the electrons that's why these attraction these attraction will uh, reduces the flowing of electron that is the first problem with the left hand side electrode left hand side off cell or anodic off cell reaction okay so now here if it is copper plus 2 solution so copper sulfate solution having the like a more number it, it is the copper sulfate solution copper sulfate solution means here it is the copper plus 2 so these copper plus 2 will gains the electron from from zinc sulfate solution that means uh, anodic cell so these these are formed as a copper so if in in case of copper sulfate solution here copper plus 2 and say so4 minus 2 so uh, like let us assume here 100 copper plus 2s are there 100 so4 minus 2 are there that means uh, 100 molecules are present in our solution let us assume okay so here some of the copper plus two ions will liberate will deposit it at the copper metal as a copper metal as a copper metal that means uh, after a certain time here 30 molecules liberated at uh, deposited at the cathode the remaining things are 70 copper plus two 100 so4 minus two are present so here the more number of negative charges are present so that means a uh, more number of uh, more number of uh, anions are present anions are present so here the more number of anions will repel the electrons now here the flowing of electrons will approaches the electron over here these electrode so electron and your negative charge electron that means they both are repelled to each other so here here it is also disturbing disturbs the like a flow, flowing of electron here it is also disturb the flowing of electron now here here attraction forces will disturb distracted now the second ripple ripple you portions repulsions repulsions of electron electron and negative charges it uh, disturb the like flowing of electrons okay so th this is the two problems which are used in the like wire method of uh, voltaic cells so these two problems were verified by using the salt bridge so with the help of salt bridge these two problems are solved
these two problems are solved how it is solved let us go through the so solution of these two problems now the first problem is so attraction of more number of cations will attract will attract the electrons so that's why flowing of electrons are reduced here uh, some of the electrons flow to the to the like right hand side right hand of, uh, of cell that means here it is cathodic half cell so here the electron uh, gaining of electron capacity repelled by the more number of negative ions these are the two problems now these two problems are solved by the salt bridge how it is used how it is used in the like galvanic cells now let us discuss the complete solution okay now let us discuss the like uses of salt bridge how it is used uh, where it is uh, where it is used in the like salt bridge okay now here it is the half cell representation here it is the another half cell so here it is filled by the zinc sulfate solution here it is filled by the copper sulfate solution here it is filled by the copper sulfate solution zinc sulfate and copper sulfate solution okay so here in zinc sulfate solution we dipped the some of the rod that is zinc rod in copper sulfate solution we dipped the like a copper sulfate rod so these two are connected through a wire so here it is the wire okay so now here the zinc rod whenever electricity is passed the zinc rod that is anodic rod so these anodic rod will gives the like more number of cations in left compartment here the more number of anions in right compartment so here it is the cathode okay cathode will gives the more number of anions anode will gives the more number of that means left compartment here it is the more number of cations right compartment or more number of negative ions so here an uncertainty that means any neutrality is present over there so any neutrality which is filled by the our uh, like a salt bridge so here it maintains the electrical neutrality so here it is the salt bridge here it is the salt bridge okay so it seems to be like an inverted u type bend an inverted it is an inverted it is an inverted u type bend u type tube okay so it is an inverted u tube so here it the ends of a u the ends of salt bridge fitted by the holes ends of salt bridge ends of salt bridge fitted by the wool so that wool here why you is used the wool that is um, like a uh, like a, it reduces the it reduces the like diffusion it reduces the diffusion that's why it is used the like a hole now again in the u in the like a u tube u type bend that is a salt bridge so here it is the salt bridge filled with a concentrated solution concentrated solution so here those concentrated solutions are nacl kcl nh4cl or kno3 like nh4 no3 or k2so4 so these type of solutions these type of concentrated solutions filled in our uh, u type band again so these type of solutions with uh, agar agar gel or gelatin agar agar gel or gelatin okay now here these agar agar gel and gelatins or gelatins these are dissolved in u type bend which contains a concentrated any one of these type of solution any one of the concentrated these one of these of the solutions okay now let us assume here it is the u type bend so it is u type bend reversely u type bend so in u type bend we have the like a, some of the concentrated solution among the one of the these uh, represented solutions okay so that is concentrated solution in concentrated solution we dissolve the either agar agar gel or gelatin in that okay so after certain time uh, we cool the those tube then here it appears as a, it sets as a, a gelatin it sets as a gelatin form so that means uh, like a gem uh, like it is a gel form it forms the gel not the gelatin okay so those just gel form here it maintains the neutrality now 
this is the construction of salt bridge construction of salt bridge here it is a u type band it ends uh, both the ends uh, fitted by the wool so now the salt bridge having the concentrated solution of these nacl kcl nh4cl kno3 nh4 no3 k2so4 so along with uh, some of the agar agar gel or gelatin agar agar gel or gelatin so this is the like a salt bridge construction now what is the uses of salt bridge what is the uses of salt bridge in our daniel cells in our daniel cells now here more number of cations present at the left compartment less more number of anions present the right compartment so here it it allows the ions mobility it allows the ions so here uh, more number of uh, more number of cations uh, which is uh, like uh, neutralized by the L corresponding so 4 minus 2 ions more number of uh, like a cations which is neutralized by the so 4 minus 2 ions so here it permits only ions it permits only ions here it cannot mix the these two solutions here it cannot mix out these two solutions now again so in u to in u type band we use the only inert electrolyte these are all the inert electrolytes okay here we used only inert electrolytes not the any type of uh, electrolytes and that means the reacted electrolytes so why because here uh, in in why it is used in the inert electrolyte it cannot neither react chemically unreacted electrolytes or it cannot react the electrolytic solution let us assume here it is the silver rod is there silver silver chloride solution silver uh, like a silver sulfate solution is there the silver sulfate solution uh, present at the left compartment let us assumed okay so now in our uh, salt bridge we have the like a kcl solution so here if uh, our ag plus and cl minus are reacted then it forms ag cl type of precipitate so that is the chemical reactive compounds whenever we use the salt bridge that is chemically in react uh, that uh, unreactive species only are used in the salt bridge that is only used in the salt bridge okay so now the key features of salt bridge now the key features of salt bridge salt bridge okay so now the first feature so here it connects the two solutions of so it connects the solutions of two of cells and completes the circuit and completes the circuit completes the like electrical circuit now it it completes the electrical circuit now the second feature so here it prevents the it prevents the like a transference or diffusion it prevents the transference or diffusion that means uh, diffusion means uh, the flowing of anything the flowing of uh, uh, like a solution in case of our uh, like electrochemical electrochemical cells the flowing of solution from high concentrated to low concentration so here it almost all prevents the high concentration to low concentration uh, flowing that means um, so somewhat uh, here uh, one of the solution having the high concentration and another solution having the low concentration so in case of semi permeable membranes so here one 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 high concentration region to another low concentration region it is the flowing of ions it may be occurs so it also prevents the this type of diffusions this type of diffusions now the third point is it prevents the liquid liquid junction potential liquid liquid junction potential liquid liquid junction potential okay so liquid liquid junction potential what is the liquid li liquid junction potential now here it is the solution so here which is separated by the like a dry cell in case of dry cells we are using this type of sub semi permeable membranes okay so here it is the like an, a semi permeable membrane okay so left hand side that is anode right hand side that is cathode so here it is the one one solution that is copper sulfate solution let us assume here it is the copper sulfate solution here it is the zinc sulfate here it is the zinc sulfate and copper sulfate solutions so here the flowing of these two these two type of liquids will reduces the their electrode potential 
so in generally so uh, let us assume in generally the flowing of electrons the flowing of electrons that means um, here the electrode potential it may be electrode potential or the right right side direction so now the flowing of electrodes that is liquid liquid junction will uh, like a uh, left hand side uh, left hand side uh, direction so these two are opposite directions of electrode potential will reduced by the our liquid liquid junction potential that means why uh, why it is potential so now the it reduces the potential due to the liquid liquid junction at the point of liquid liquid junction in case of semi permeable semi permeable membranes those two types of liquids are joined together so at uh, at a certain point those two liquid liquid junction point uh, based on those uh, liquid liquid junction points it reduces the electrode potential it reduces the emf value so that uh, reducing of emf value by the liquid liquid junction point so that is called a liquid liquid junction potential so uh, in case of semi permeable membrane it is absorbed so but we used this salt bridge it also prevents the this type of uh, liquid liquid junction potential here there is no uh, transfer of copper sulfate solution to the left side compartment or zinc sulfate solution to the right side compartment so here it cannot uh, flow of the complete solution to the right side or complete solution to the left side so here it, it is not absorbed here it is not absorbed the both liquid liquid junction point so here if it is possible for the both liquid liquid junction point then we absorb here it, it may be somewhat, somewhat uh, some of the uh, corrections are there in our electrode potential some of the like degradation is absorbed in our uh, electrode potential so that's why it is the another important thing of the like our salt bridge it prevents the like a uh, ligand uh, like a sorry liquid liquid potential liquid liquid uh, potential now let us imagine now the final thing is that is it maintains it maintains so it maintains the solution in electrically neutral electrical neutral so that means it maintains the total solution in electrically neutrality okay now here it maintains the solution uh, solutions in electrolytical electrically neutral it maintains the solution in electrically neutral in two off cells in both the off cells both the off cells okay how it is uh, how it is uh, uh, maintained the electrically neutral okay so now in case of uh, so like a left side compartment so this is the electrode so zinc rod in zinc sulfate solution zinc rod in zinc sulfate solution in the connection of uh, our uh, like electrical wire now i'll take the left side compartment only in the connection of electrical circuit let us uh, uh, circuit the electric electricity some time that means uh, here the our zinc rod will reduces their size and here it creates the more number of zn plus 2 so here the more number of positively charged uh, species positively charged ions are accumulated surrounded by the like our anode positively charged uh, positively charged ions are accumulated surrounded the anode okay so these positively charged species will reduce the flow of electrons i think uh, in the starting of the video i had i had discussed this this concept okay so it it reduces the like flowing of electrons okay so it reduces the flowing of electrons now here more number of zn plus 2 ions are present okay so now again in um, similarly in right side compartment here it is the like a cathode so here it gains the electrons that means here gaining of electrons here already copper plus 2 is there so gaining of electrons will leads to the more number of anions more number of anions at the right side more number of anions are present so here more number of anions and the electrons are repelled repelled to each other now again it is also another problem okay here the more number of cations and more number of anions are present so these more number of cations and anions through the salt bridge here it allows the transfer of ions the salt bridge which allows the transfer of ions and it maintains the these transfer of ions from left compartment to, to right compartment it cannot uh, transfer anything other than that so that's why here yeah, the transfer of ions maintains the electrical neutrality maintains the electrical neutrality okay so uh, that's all for this video okay this is very 
a very complete uh, information regarding to the um, our salt bridge if it is possible now i'll uh, discuss the one of the problem so before going to that uh, now i let us summarize the all those things regarding to the salt bridge okay now here salt bridge that is an inverted u type band so in case of inverted u type band we used the some of the concentrated solution uh, like a kcl nac lnh 4 cl k 2 so 4 so those type of nh4 no3 okay again uh, another important point regarding to the our solutions kcl like um, NaCl these type of solution here the cation and anion so the ionic mobility that means the movement of ion the ionic mobility of cation and anion both are approximately equal equal containing compounds can only used in our salt bridge so that means uh, both ionic mobilities are equal that means uh, both the transport numbers of uh, cation and anions are equal then only used in the salt bridge so uh, which type of solutions are used in they might be asked in the uh, competitive exams which type of solutions are used in salt bridge that means uh, both ionic mobilities are same okay that is the correct option or both the transport numbers of cation and anions are approximately equal so then only it is possible okay so both the transport numbers approximate equal equal containing solutions are used in the our salt bridge that is the second point okay now again so in in, in case of uh, this type of concentrated solution filled in our uh, u type band so uh, some of the agar agar gel or gelatin compounds are dissolved in our uh, u type band then it is it it forms the uh, some of the solution that solution after certain time it cools the solution and it it sets as a like a gel gel form it sets as a gel form that gel form uh, will used as the our electrolytic our like a salt bridge our salt bridge now the now the uses of salt bridge is it it connects the or it connects the solution of two half cells and it completes the electrical circuits now the second it prevents the transference or diffusion now here diffusion means a higher concentration to lower concentration now the third point it prevents the liquid liquid junction potential now i'll discuss the these liquid liquid junction potential topic uh, in our uh, like um in front of the video now the fourth one it maintains this solution as an electrical neutral comp an electrically neutral thing so electrical neutral thing was explained by the these experiments these experiments so that's all for this video now i'll solve the one of this previous year csr problem regarding to the our salt bridge okay now Okay, guys, this is the problem in, which is given in 2018 June CSAR for 4 marker. June 2018 CSAR for 4 marker. Okay, so the correct statement among the following is salt bridge is required for the mixing of the mixing of the solution in the two half cells. It is only used for the like a mixing of two solutions. Now, the second thing. So, salt bridge allows the current to flow between the two half cells without mixing the solution now without mixing of the solutions here it is the another point now the see salt bridge enhances the rate of reaction so in complete video we are not discussed about anything regarding to the enhances of rea rate of reaction okay now the fourth one salt bridge consists of a non electrolyte in a gel so we have discussed about it is an electrolyte but it is in, in not electrolyte it is not the non electrolyte okay now we are uh, uh, we are read about uh, all the all the options now among the four which is correct option sometimes which is a proper option okay so sometimes uh, this type of uh, this type of theory based questions uh, uh, like two or uh, more than two options are very closer to the our concept but only one is the proper answer uh, other than the uh, like remaining one okay now here among the four here it cannot enhance the rate of reaction that's why c is wrong again salt bridge we use the strong electrolytic solution but we use the strong electrolytic solution but it is inert electrolyte does not react in reaction so those type of uh, uh, electrolytes are used in the gel okay so in a gel okay now the th uh, a and b so here we used the salt bridge without mixing of the solution so that is the major requirement for the like our salt bridge representation why you use, use it the solution so it cannot uh, mix it the liquid liquid jun junction point here in case of salt bridge uh, those two types of solutions cannot mix it the uh, at a certain point here the flow of ions maybe takes place here cannot mix it the solutions that's why here the mixing of solutions is also wrong so through the elimination method we will get the four marks in csr exam very easier okay so that is this is the final option so that is the b
sometimes they are given in the copy paste questions from uh, like uh, from CSAR to JE mains so it is very helpful for the JE students also okay note these type of problems so that's all for this video this is very helpful and conceptualized topic of the salt bridge okay thank you so much for watching